from the Outdoor Channel. Lovely to meet nice you. To Lovely to see you. Hi, I'm Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Well, come on in. We're, we're live right now to the Outdoor Channel, and we didn't think we'd get an opportunity to speak to such a legend, but he, here we are, and I'm a little bit speechless. Yeah, I mean, the first time going to the Opry, I saw you play, so you can be starstruck. It's all right. I'm a little bit starstruck, and that doesn't happen very often, but, you know, you're somebody who's paved the way for a lot of people, and it's an honor to get to chat with you. Thank you. Well, I've had a lot of fun doing it for a whole lot of years. They said this is the 56th. CMA awards and I've been to about 54 55 of them so never gets old and I'm introducing my granddaughter Hallie to it tonight she's never been and it's kind of exciting for her because she loves country music that must be really lovely for you to get to pass on these traditions to your family well really she's of all my grandchildren and all she's the one that loves country music the most so uh, I wanted her to see a little bit about what it's like from the inside out and so in terms of introducing her to music, have you been pretty selective on that? <laughs> well, she's kind of found her own way. Uh, she's found her own artists that she likes and the kind of songs and all that she likes. I'm not trying to force anything yeah. on her at all and just uh, tried to make it available. Hey, this is what it is. If you want to get involved with it, uh, this is what it is. And this is what it costs to be in it. <laughs> so who are some of your favorite artists at the moment? Um, Luke Combs and Carly Pierce are my two favorites. I love Jordan Davis. They're all great options right there. So Bill, um, can you tell us what are some of the lessons that you've learned in your incredible career? <laughs> oh, oh, everything is a lesson. <laughs> Every day I wake up. Um, I, I don't know. I think probably the thing that I try to pass along to other people, the young writers that I write with, the young artists that I've toured with and all over the years, is uh, is don't take this business for granted. You know, you gotta you got to be prepared to work at it if you want to be in it. Uh, respect it for what it is, what the history is, and look forward to the, the future. I mean, the kind of music I've done all these years is not going to be the kind of music that people are going to be doing 25, 30 years from now. In fact, they're not doing a lot of it today. Yeah. But just kind of carve your own path and uh, good luck. <laughs> that's, that's absolutely brilliant. So this is the Outdoor Channel and we always like to ask people if they enjoy the outdoors and if they do what their passions are. Oh my goodness. I uh, I love to walk. I love to exercise. love to be outdoors. love to go to the beach and take off my shoes and walk in the sand. <laughs> I'm not a I'm not a hunter or a fisherman. I, I don't get into that too much, but uh, love love the outdoors. Love to get on a bicycle and ride around. Well, you're out, you like outdoors, don't you? I love them. Yes, I love to swim, ride my bike. I love it. That's wonderful, and that's everything we love to hear. And you know, we love to be out in God's creation as much as we absolutely can. Well, wear that hat because uh, uh. nature may not be ready for that. And if you get tired of it, I want it. <laughs> Thank you. So, Bill, before you leave, do you have any last bit of advice for any up-and-coming artists? Well, like I said, just uh, if you want to be in this business, realize that it is a business. You know, it's called show business. It's half show and it's half business. And just recognize that and go for it and good luck. Wonderful. Well, thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you guys have a wonderful night together. It's lovely that you get to share that together. Thank you so much. God bless. Thank you.